Ladies and gentlemen, this card looks an absolute steal for 120,000 coins. Oh my days, I am looking forward to trying this card. Before we get into today's video lads, if you guys want to check out my Davis Plays Clips channel, that would be much appreciated, the links will be in the description. Majority of the clips are taken from my Twitch channel, they range from maybe 20 seconds to a minute long, icon packs, 84 times 25 packs, and all of that good stuff. Make sure to drop it a sub lads, and enjoy the video. 93 rated team of the season, Dimitri Payet or Payet, I think it is actually pronounced in France. 5 foot 9, high medium with 4 star, 4 star, 93 pace, 92 shooting which is very solid as it is. And look at those passing stats, 98 crossing, 96 vision, 99 free kick accuracy which definitely makes sense. 96 short passing, 93 long passing and 96 curve. His dribbling stats as well are very phenomenal. If I had to nitpick, I'd say the 86 composure is bringing that down a little bit in front of net he's not going to be as composed as you'd like him to be but stamina wise 91 stamina 88 strength as well so he's relatively strong for a five foot nine man flare tray and outside the foot shot tray as well now for the chemistry style we're going to go ahead and go for a hawk and assuming you've got a full chemistry team and payet himself is on full chemistry he goes to a 94 rated striker 96 left wing and 96 cam it just gives him that little pace boost that extra shooting boost but that plus five strength and plus 10 aggression the aggression doesn't matter too much for a striker but that plus five strength and just maxing that pace and shooting out as it is is fine his passing obviously doesn't need an upgrade and his dribbling as it is is already good enough you could debate you want to get those 87 reactions up but we are going to try him out with the hawks uh, in today's video lads this card looks absolutely phenomenal now as well he's five foot nine with a stocky body type now the stocky body type i don't personally have any complaints with personally but i know it's it's you know one you'd even love or hate it's like olives right you'll either love them or you'll hate them depending on the person if you guys have used benzema benzema's got like a unique type of stocky body type now benzema's a stocky body type but he's really tall as well so imagine benzema's body type but a lot shorter that's what payet is gonna feel like let's let's get in to the review and let's test him out in some games now we are going to be playing a Payet as a striker if it wasn't obvious enough from the starting formation. So we'll see how he goes there, but he's one of the cards that can play Cam. Obviously his natural position is actually a center forward. So center forward, Cam, striker. Um, you could even play him as a left wing if you want, but I feel like you really want to be using him as a striker. I think he just suits that striker or central role more than he would a wider role. Anyway, Payet's first touch with it. Now, the stocky body type, personally, I don't mind at all. I actually really like that body type. And that is a ridiculously good ball from Payet, but Gals and Martins can't quite get to that. On Atal wins it back. Atal, Payet making that run, which is perfect. Over the top to Neymar. Neymar, can you finish it? Of course you can, baby. That is an assist for Dimitri Payet, and that is a phenomenal assist as well. What a ball pinpoint where I wanted it. Now, when you're taking corners, Payet has to be on it. 99 power, 99 free kicks, 96 curve. You have to put him on the corner. Look at the curve on that. And Marquinhos actually connects to that as well. Um, and it does go out for a goal kick. You look at that run. Once again, the high attacking work rates does him wonders. Should we run it back? Run it back. Neymar, run it back. That is pinpoint exact. That's basically how the first goal went as well. First game's a 2-0 win. Payet picking up two assists. Absolutely phenomenal, man. It literally, but, but my player who got two goals still got a lower match rating than Payet who got both assists, which does tell you that this Payet card is absolutely phenomenal. Absolutely phenomenal performance. He offered more than just goals, and he easily could have had a goal if my opponent's keeper wasn't insane. But both of his assists, man... The curve, the crosses, the curve on those assists is absolutely wonderful. You see into the next game, boys. A very good first game from him. Aim over the interception straight away. Up to Payet. Lovely fake shot. Good turn as well. Sends Neymar through. Gone. I want to score a goal for Payet this game. That would, that would have been an absolutely brilliant goal, by the way. Gone. Payet. All-star skills around. Shoot that. He does kind of get that shot away. Go on, Nguyen Minj into the box. Payet, fake shot around. Finish that, son. Absolutely beautiful. Come on. That's a defender assist as well for the objectives. But there it is, boys. Payet's first goal for the club. Great positioning. A very nice uh, fake shot around as well. And he just bangs that near post. Lovely ball over the top. I love this card's link-up play. 
like vivid link up and and i feel like if you use a four three three or a four triple two a formation with like a right cam left cam didn't mean to hit my keyboard there right wing left wing he, he's gonna link up so so well with your wingers it's absolutely amazing like the link up play between payet and my neymar and galson martins is phenomenal and not only that he's got the high high medium work rate so he'll pass the ball to them and then he'll sprint into the box and get into that striker role i really like this card man he's got the perfect work rates that like actually like complement his actual really good passing stats if that makes sense he's like a proper center forward like he plays like a prime Roberto Firmino in Liverpool's system in real life role if that makes sense and I'm digging it quite a lot from Payet around one more big shot cancel finish there we are boys yeah this card's ridiculous I absolutely love this card man absolutely love it I think he got a little nutmeg there didn't he he definitely got a nutmeg there. Go on, Yun Mensch. To Neymar. Neymar, there we go. That's a defender assist as well from Yun Mensch. That's the second one this game. We're getting these Dante objectives done while trying out this card. And it's good as well because this is a very sweaty game. Um, but Payet with a very nice ball roll nutmeg and a bit of a semi-assist there from him. Linking up with Yun Mensch who is currently playing left wing for me. From Payet, the last touch of the game for the hat trick, for the hat trick, and the very last kick of the game, he gets his well deserved hat trick. That is absolutely phenomenal. Absolutely phenomenal. Two games, he gets himself a match ball, he gets a hat trick, and he also gets two assists. Lads, this card, five goal contributions in, in what, in two games is absolutely phenomenal. I'm really, really in love with this card. So starting off chemistry style, we have gone for a Hawk, obviously. Uh, pros have gone for 93 pace, 92 shooting, 94 shot power, and 93 attacking positioning. Gone for 96 passing, and instead of going in depth and naming every single stat under his passing, we'll just say that 96 passing, or 95 passing, um, either, or 95. I, I think he's got 95 passing, but I think he might have 96 short passing or something, which is why I put it down. But potato, potato, right? It's absolutely unreal either way. His passing is phenomenal. Uh, 96 ball control with 91 uh, stamina and his traits are absolutely exceptional as well. His trait, he's got the flair trait and outside of the foot shot trait. Now, the only con we've gone for is 86 composure and it is a very, very big nitpick. I do think the stocky body type is not going to be a pro for me because I personally don't mind it, but I know obviously he's not going to feel as good left stick dribbling as a Neymar or something like that with a lean body type. But once Payet has got some phenomenal dribbling stats, he still feels absolutely insane, right? Um, now, 86 composure, as I said, is a massive nitpick. I do think maybe there's one instance where that composure let him down a little bit. And if you are playing him as a striker, then you can count that as a, as a con. But if you're playing him as a cam or a winger, it will be absolutely zero issue whatsoever. Now, the overall rating out of 10... I mean, based on his value and how good he is in game, I'm going to give him a 9.75 out of 10. Not quite a 9.8. I think for perspective, I gave Prime a 9 and 9.9. .9. So the fact I'm giving this pie yet a 9. Point, um, a 9.75 meaning he's only one and a half ratings off of uh, R9 tells you what you need to know. Now, introducing the new better van or worse van section we added a week or so ago. Now, I think this Payet card, I think he's better than Fakir and Diaby, but I do not think he is as good as Moments Heroes Adibi or Abidi Pale, I think it is. And I also do not think he's going to be as good as Team of a Season Paqueta. But all in all, for the price, and I mean, like Paqueta's 1.4 million and Pale's like, what, 600, 700k. And this card's only 100k. So I probably think he's better value. I just don't think he's better in game as them. This card's phenomenal, lads. A great cam, striker, center forward, left wing, right wing, left mid if you want. And that's the beauty of him as well. Not only is he cracked, he's very versatile. Toll. Hope you guys did enjoy, and I'll uh, see you guys in the next one.